Hi everybody, hopefully I'll get this to take this time. I've been trying to shoot this video for a few minutes now. And it's still messing up on me. Well, anyway, I want to quickly get on here and do a quick movie, another movie review of a movie I just saw. That's related to another movie that I've already reviewed on here. Uh, the movie that I already reviewed was The Craft. Um, you know, with Faruza Book, Robin Tooney, Nave Cannibal, and Robin True in it. I'm not going to be talking about this movie. I'm going to be talking about a movie that's related to this movie. Um, this movie, of course, was released back in the 1990s, and it's a really good movie, as I've already said. And I'm not going to rehash what I said in the other video about this movie. But I wanted to say, you know, if you haven't seen what I said about this movie, go back and, you know, watch what I said about this movie in the earlier review. Now, related to this movie, they've made a sequel of it. And I want to talk about that movie, which is The Craft Legacy. Uh, this is actually, I just watched this movie tonight. Um, and I've been wanting to watch this for a while, and it got released, you know, like in, like, I think, like, 19, or 19, 2019 or 2020, I can't remember which, but I think that, that sounds right. Well, because this is like a follow-up, or a sequel, like I said, to The Craft. So, um, I would recommend watching this movie first, just because it'll make a little more sense. When you watch this movie. Um, you know. Uh, one of the guys in this movie. Is David Duchovny. Uh, and. It's got. Kaylee Spaney. Gideon Adelon. Lovey Simone. Zoe Lena. With Michelle Monaghan. And David Duchovny. Uh, David Duchovny. I have to say. Is really good in this movie. And the four girls in this movie are, like, really, really, really good in this movie. And I do highly recommend it. Um, but I do recommend, like I said, watching The Craft, you know, this craft first, just because, I mean, it's just, like, th this, you know, is, like I said, a sequel to this. And, it, and this movie will make a lot more sense if you watch The Craft, the original craft, first. Um... Uh, and David Duchovny's character in that movie, I mean, I'm just like, it's like that, he's really good in the movie. I have to give him mad props for that. Uh, I won't ruin the ending, but I do actually like Legacy. It's actually, it, it was actually not what I expected, I have to say. I mean, it wasn't. I was like, I watched it and I thought, that is so, so not what I expected. I mean, it, it's just, like, I kind of, I figured it would be, you know, along the lines of the original craft, and it is, to a point, but then it's like, it's like a totally different animal from the original movie, um, and the ending is like, okay, uh, and, and I'm like, it just, I don't say that, like, in a bad way, mind you. I say it as in, like, okay, I didn't see that coming. It's like The Others. Like, at the end of The Others, how I talked about that in that movie review. For that movie, I mean, it's it's got like an ending like that where you're like, okay, I did not, I did not see that coming at all. I was like, oh, like, wow. I mean, seriously. I mean, that's what I, I, I sat here and said. I was like, Okay, I did not see that coming. Uh, one thing, though, and I do have to say this. Um, the boy that they cast a spell on in Legacy is nothing like uh, Skeech, Skeech, or Skeech Yorick's character in the craft, in the original craft. I mean, it's... And... Uh, what happens when the one little girl, you know, comes in on the, you know, to be their fourth? Uh, one thing happens to her at the beginning of the movie, and I felt so bad for her, you know, because 
Um, and this won't ruin the ending or anything, but at the beginning she has an accident on herself. And the boy that they end up putting a spell on ridicules her for having an accident on herself. I won't say what kind of accident. You know, I'm just going to leave it at that. You have to watch the movie to see what it is. But she has a, she has a, you know, accident on herself. Like, bathroom accident on herself. Is what I'm going to say. She, a bathroom type of accident on herself. And, you know, the other girls, you know come to her and say, you know, hey, it happens to everybody, you know, don't feel bad, and that boy is a bit of a horse's backside about everything, you know, and, and I'm like, and, and that's one thing I like about the movie is, that especially at the beginning, how the three, the other three girls were, like, not like the other three when Robin Tooney's character came in the craft, um, you know, it's like, these three girls were like, you know, hey, accidents happen, you know, the one girl said, here, you know, I know these shorts are, I wore them in gym, and are, you know, a little bit on the skanky side, but, you know, hey, here, you know, let, let us help you out, you know, things happen, don't be upset about it, that guy's a jerk anyway, was what they said, and I thought, you know what, I wish, I wish that, you know, that, that's what I like the most about the movie, is, like, at the beginning, it shows these three girls being nice to the new girl. And I, I I love seeing that. And I wish that they would have more movies where it's like, you know, instead of being catty with each other, the girls are like, you know, hey, accidents happen. Don't worry about it. You know, <clears throat> let us help you out, whatever. And that's what I really liked about the movie was that part there. I was like, you know. And then it's like it made the ending that much more better when, like, they, you know, did, you know, it ended how it ended, is what I want to say. Um, and I do strongly recommend watching this movie, but I do recommend watching The Craft first because it's a continuation of that movie. Well, anyway, I'm going to pause here because I've got another review I want to do, all right? So hang on. <laughs> 